In my personal opinion, the Alliance Brothers and the Confederation Brothers, both here on Earth, is a good system. In my opinion, I think I personally think that it's God's uh, system. In my opinion, I think the Confederation are like the angels in the Bible and God's expression of mercy and the conf uh, and the alliance is an expression of God's justice and like the Lord of Heaven's army in the Bible. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, I can find... What supports this theory to me is in the book uh, Inside the Spaceships by Adamski. Uh, there's a... The, the Confederation Brother states right here, page uh, 225. Meanwhile, we keep ourselves ever alerted to receive the call for whatever help men of Earth may truly desire, for they are still our brothers. So the main purpose being, in my opinion, the angels. They are here on Earth mostly to help people. Help them to evolve, as they state right here. What it really means is that when an individual on your Earth has risen above the ignorance of his brothers into a higher understanding of life, rebirth on another planet is permitted. He will come through with a vivid memory of his experience on Earth. Predominant will be his conception of the fundamental laws that govern all life. Memories of his daily habits, his relationship with his family and associates, while still clear, will be secondary. He will realize that there is no missing links between the two stages of life, but a continuity of development uncluttered by the many names and divisions which confused him on Earth. So, it is my opinion that the Confederation... We're like the angels, I hear mostly to help people to evolve and to make it into their worlds with their memory intact. And the memory intact is done through a soul transfer machine at the time of death. They take the soul and transfer it into a new body. So it's like in the Bible it mentions that in heaven we have new bodies. The soul transfer machine is mentioned in uh, Howard Menger's Threads of Light to you. I'm showing this symbol because also to me it's a balance on Earth that the Confederation is God's mercy and the Alliance is God's justice in my opinion or angels and Lord of Heaven's army. So it's like the Confederation is mercy and yin and the Alliance uh, brothers are like Justice and their Yang. Um, over here we can see Brother RK mention, let's see. Ah, he mentions that their main purpose right here, uh, our purpose has been and continues to be the physical removal of the Negan influence from your world. He says, there's nothing spiritual about it. So, their main reason for being here is to re removal of the Negans and other evil groups. So, that um, that's one of the reasons why I believe the two groups 
from the comments of the Confederation operative about wanting to help people in uh, Adamski's Inside the Spaceships and the comments of Brother R.K. in removing God's enemies. Uh, leads me to the theory that the since both worship the same God, the Confederation is an expression of God's mercy and alliance is an expression of God's justice. Also, uh, I think this theory goes well with the Sermon on the Mount, especially the Our Father prayer. Brother Gabriel Green had a uh, used to have a magazine called Thy Kingdom Come, and he was friends with uh, Brother Bob, and it was, uh, he was talking about bringing the, in the uh, I think it was on his website, he talked about the Alliance and the Confederation. The kingdom come, I believe, means that the that the confederation and the alliance will come openly to Earth. So I believe the Our Father is actually a prayer that can be, in, to me, is a prayer about God's plan of using the confederation to help people like the angels while using the alliance to eliminate God's enemies and so they can come to earth openly and do, do yeah so in this prayer it says our father who is in heaven uh, hallowed blessed be thy name your kingdom come which would be the conf uh, alliance and confederation you will be done according to his will, so I believe his will is, the confederation is his mercy, while the alliance is his justice on earth as it is in heaven. In other words, uh, how making earth like how it is in alliance and confederation worlds. Give us today our daily bread. That's just to remember his teachings and forgive us our debts or sins as we also have forgiven those who are debtors or those who sin against us. And lead us not into temptation. Continue to be, try to be moral as best you can. And deliver us from the evil one. Evil ones, I believe, are like the Amigans and CTRs and things like that. So this is the prayer, and it even tells, in the prayer it tells earth people what to do. Who to, who to pray for? And what to do. It says, For if you forgive other people when they sin against you, your Heavenly Father will also forgive you. But if you do not forgive others their sins, your Father will not forgive your sins. So it tells earth people to be moral and to forgive so your sins are forgiven and to pray for the positive, pray for the Alliance and Confederation to come here openly and to pray that God defeats the evil through using the Confederation and the Alliance. And when people forgive the evil and they're following the teachings of Jesus, as it says right here, blessed, blessed are those who are persecuted because of righteousness for the kingdom, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. It says right there that they're guaranteed to make it into heaven. Or Confederation worlds, if you like with their memory intact, as long as they're sincere. So, that's my theory about the Alliance and Confederation system, which I think is very good on Earth. I call it God's system. Because in my opinion, God is guiding the confederation to help out people and guiding the 
alliance to remove its enemies. So they're mutually beneficial. That's why I like neutral planets and stuff like that. Uh, okay. In, in the future, I'd like to in, uh, incarnate into with Buck Nelson's group with a memory intact, so I continue to be part of God's uh, mercy and uh, lead people to my books and stuff like that, so they can do it too. And at the same time, support the Lions Brothers because. Because, in my opinion, they're, they're equally important in the other half of the balance. Because God, in my opinion, is both merciful and just. Okay, thank you and God bless.